Good morning, Sparrows Point Middle School. Today is Friday, May 5th, and it is an A day. My name is Bella. And my name is Kaya. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. My mic has a red light. You may be seated. We would like to wish a happy birthday to Ronnie G, Mason B, Oscar F, and Michelle W, and over the weekend to Owen C. The weather today is 70 degrees and rainy. Today's lunch, pizza, cheese, or pepperoni, cheesesteak sub, chicken patty sandwich, regular spicy, grilled cheese sandwich, robust tomato soup, and seasoned potato wedges, and, can and assorted canned fruit. Here is the seventh grade coach class schedule. If you'd like to see these teachers get pied, give donations to Miss Perry in room 217 this week. Today is the last day for the book fair. It closes at the end of B lunch. Seventh grade is eating, eating at A lunch, and sixth grade is eating on B lunch. Miss Cerritos would like to wish the SPMS 24 finalists the best of luck at their 24 competition tomorrow morning. Good luck, Ashley Cook and Franklin Benz. Miss Cerritos is so proud of you both. And now for the word of the week. The word of the week was anthology. It means a public collection of poems or other pieces of writing. Today is your last chance to find Principal Washington from his drawing during the change of classes. Use the word in the sentence and sh that shows you know the meaning and get a prize. Now a book fair video. Now a message from Ms. Chadwick. Okay. Good morning, Sparrows Point Middle School. Today is the last day we'll be celebrating children's mental health, so I am here to bring you the last coping skill of the day. Today's coping skill of the day is talking to someone who cares about you. Talking to someone who cares about you helps you feel understood and supported. And they may be able to help you solve your problems. Think of people you can talk to at home, at school, and in the neighborhood. Don't keep yourself to, to yourself when you are hurting, scared, or angry. Remember, your mental health matters. And as always, myself and Ms. Weinstein are available if you need our support. Have a good weekend. Hi, how's everybody doing? Hi. Last summer we had an amazing time with the summer bridge program here at Sparrows Point. It, it was, was fun. It was fun, right? Yeah. I put her on because I figured you guys wouldn't believe me if I said it, but um, newsletters went out inviting certain students to attend the summer bridge program, and the letters have to be returned so we can get the numbers to keep this program going. And we have math and language arts reading and then we did a really awesome stem hour so we were able to do different projects like what do you remember rover cars. what's that we built like rover cars rover cars spaghetti towers, spaghetti towers. um keep had to keep the marshmallow up there was an egg drop yeah it was all it was fun it was a good time and um again please return the letters to school so that we know who's in attendance so we can have this amazing summer 
It was really fun. Yeah. If you're and, going, I think you'll like it. And hopefully she comes again. So thank you very much. And if you have any questions about it, see me or Miss Stack. And again, the letters were sent out, so we need them back ASAP. And now, Miss Washington. Good morning, Sparrows Point Middle, and welcome to this fabulous, fabulous Friday. I know that it is gloomy and rainy outside, but it is bright and sunny inside here at the Point. Uh, I'm hoping that all of our students are focused and ready to learn. I, I know there was a lot of excitement this morning. Uh, nevertheless, <clears throat> you all are still here to learn, so hopefully you are still focused and ready to learn. <coughs> I'm sorry, the, I, my allergies are acting crazy this morning. I just have a couple of quick announcements. Again, you all know the book fair today is the last day for the book fair. I plan on stopping in there uh, right after announcements, if Ms. Farrell will allow me to do so, to check out all of the great things. I'm rocking my green today, so I know I look crazy on the screen. But again, this is the last day for children's mental health awareness. And again, thank you to all staff and students who supported the cause. And I'm just going to jump right into Friday flashlights because it's Friday. All right, the first flashlight I have for many of the adults, if you follow me on Twitter, last night I had the uh, esteemed pleasure and honor to be around our TAPCO Rookie of the Year, Ms. Sikulski. So I'm going to give her a flashlight. So way to go, Ms. Sikulski. And I'd also like to give a flashlight to those who came to support her yesterday. So we had Ms. Perry was in attendance, Ms. Durham was in attendance, Ms. Bonnie. Miss Kane, Miss Fox, Miss Sutton, and Miss Sikulski's fiance and her parents were in attendance. So I'm giving a shout out to the whole crew uh, because we had a, a table yesterday and we enjoyed the fellowship uh, and we, it was a wonderful event to celebrate Miss Sikulski. And as she said it, she's uh, rocking it. Uh, her words, not mine. So way to go, Miss Sikulski. Thank you for making us proud and representing the point well. I'd also like to give Ms. Johnson a shout out um, for all of your assistance in the office. You're awesome. I don't think Ms. Johnson is here this morning, but at least I, and I will make sure that you are aware of your flashlight. To Lane Brick for helping a student pick up her belongings. Way to go, Lane, for doing the right thing. Um, and a student actually wrote this to Ms. Spencer for always having a great attitude and helping out. So again, I'd also like to give a shout out to Ms. Chadwick and to Ms. Weinstein for their assistance uh, with putting together another great event for School Spirit with the supporting the cause of children's mental health awareness. I'd also like to give Mr. Dees a shout out, a uh, flashlight if you will. Thank you. That's all I'm going to say. Thank you. Uh, again, it's Friday. I'm hoping that everyone you have a safe and enjoyable weekend. I believe our countdown is now at 27, 26 days, excuse me, 26 days. So students, again, I need you to finish strong make the right decisions the first time uh, speaking along decisions take some time now students to make sure your phones are off all cell phones should be off and out of sight so please do that at this time teachers please give students about five seconds to make sure they are taking care of those things uh, also with dress code i have mentioned it i will continue to say it students your teachers are the fashion police and experts if they say it's too short it's too short uh, so please make sure that you take care of it or when in doubt Bring a backup plan, a backup outfit, or just don't even wear it to begin with. Um, I think the fidgets, I've talked about those things. Also, students have been making slime and doing some other stuff during instructional time. Students, we're, we shouldn't be doing that. Not in a math class, if that's not what your math teachers have set out for the objectives for the day. Of course, if you're doing experiments in science, rock on, continue with it. Uh, but again, students, I wanna make sure that you understand that when you are in class, you should be focused on the instruction. If your teacher is doing something or having you engaged in an activity, that's where your focus should be, not on doing whatever it is you want to do. Um, that's not the option, and that's not why your parents send you here every day. Again, this is your full-time job. Um, so I just wanted to make sure that we I set that message and share that yet again 
um, because I know students, you know what it is you need to do. Make today a great day. Uh, the choice is totally up to you. Either way, students, I'm going to love you regardless. Have a fabulous Friday. Again, next week we will kick off Faculty and Staff Appreciation Week. All week there will be some things happening for the great staff here. So students, again, please begin thinking about how you will show your appreciation for all of the staff in the building. So again, I want to say thank you to everyone. Have a great weekend. I think it's free read Friday. I'm reading the book Ghost. Thank you, Ms. Farrell, for recommending that book. I'm reading it. It's an awesome book. Now I will turn it back over to our fabulous news crew. I'll get the quote. And the quote of the day, the secret to getting things done is to act. Dante Alighieri. Thanks for watching. I'm Bella. And I'm Kai. Remember to find all that you do. Now for free read Friday. <laughs>